Hey everyone, Chris here and welcome to another AV product brief. There's a lot to like about the idea of a webcam soundbar combo. Compared to installing mics and speakers and a processor into a room, the combo design is about as easy to install as an item of AV gear can be. Bose calls the concept a video bar, hence the VB1 moniker. It's designed to be placed on a tabletop or a wall mounted. Its primary method of connection is via USB-C. From my end, it's as easy as popping the USB-C plug into my laptop and connecting to the room's display via HDMI. But if it was this easy to achieve amazing VC results in small and mid-sized rooms, surely everyone would be doing a product like the VB1. And there'd be no market for mics and in-ceiling speakers from the likes of Buy Am Sure, Sennheiser, Clear One and Stem Audio. And really, the success or failure of such a system is down to the performance of the microphones. If you're on VC calls all day and intelligibility is absolutely paramount, then a good headset mic is impossible to beat. But you risk looking like a gamer or a drive through fast food operative. From there, as soon as you start to put distance between you and the mic, the smarter the system needs to be to maintain great intelligibility. The main tools in the drawer are echo cancellation and beam forming microphones. The Bose VB1 has both. There are six arrayable mics in the VB1 that can form four distinct pickup beams. If you have a VB1 installed in a huddle space with four seats around a table, you can choose to set and lock those beam positions in the VB1 management software. Otherwise, VB1 will go hunting for the louder sources and the auto mic mixer and AEC go to work to maximize intelligibility. Bose quotes a six meter range for its microphones. Here's what the VB1 sounds like in our space. This is a test of the Bose VB1 video bar in our mid, mid-sized studio with some acoustic treatment, six meters away. This is a test of the Bose VB1 video bar in the same room, four meters away. This is a test of the Bose VB1 video bar, two meters away. This is a test of the VB1 video bar, one meter away. The VB1 might appear to be a natural extension of the Bose work line of business problem solvers, but to realize this product, it meant Bose had to start an optics department from scratch. Yes, this is Bose's own camera technology. It's a 4K camera operating in an HD and SD VC world. It uses H.264 compression, features five times zoom, and that extra 4K resolution comes in handy when you're zooming and auto framing. It's a 120 degree field of view camera, the results are excellent with minimal fisheye distortion. The light management and auto contrasting are also well handled. The VB1 plays nicely with all of the usual VC suspects. That said, Bose is putting more chips on Teams and the integration is deep. Microsoft Teams has gone ballistic in Australia over the last year or so, and the tight integration is a big selling point. Bose is well entrenched in the primo soundbar market with its home theater products. So you'd expect this aspect to be well handled, and it is. But don't expect the VB1 to double as an all-singing, all-dancing, multi-channel movie monster. It's designed to reproduce speech in the main. Finally, aesthetically, the VB1 doesn't disappoint. It's beautifully slim and well-resolved. Doubtlessly, the, the Bose trolls will suggest that thanks to the supermodel good looks that the VB1 is another Bose triumph of marketing over substance. Let the trolls troll. The VB1 is a winner, especially in smaller huddle spaces.